Where does rain come from? Every day you will be notified with a new video which improves your knowledge day by day. So, don't forget to subscribe. Rain is very important in our life. Rain helps farmers to grow crops. It keeps our earth green and clean. Rain is fresh water, which is very good for drinking. Without rain, the land, ponds, rivers will be dry. Finally, our earth will not be a green planet. So, have you ever thought about from where the rain comes? The sun heats the water in the rivers, lakes, oceans, and any water bodies. The water turns into water vapor. The process of changing water into water vapor is called evaporation. Since water vapor is lighter than water, it rises to the sky. In the sky, the water vapor cools and change into tiny droplets which forms clouds. This process of changing water vapor into water droplet is called condensation. The clouds are carried here and there by the wind. The water droplets in the clouds join together to form bigger drops. When the water droplet get too large and heavy, they fall to the ground because of gravity. This water droplets falling to the ground as rain is called precipitation. Now, the rain water that falls on the ground flow through lakes, streams, and rivers. Finally, it reaches the sea. Again, cycle repeats. Evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. This cyclical process is known as the water cycle. Even plants and trees have a cooling effect on the atmosphere, leading to rainfall. Plants' leaves have small holes, known as stomata. Through the stomata, the plants release extra water in the form of water vapor. This process is called transpiration. The water vapor from the plants rises to the atmosphere and condensation takes place to form clouds. Then, precipitation takes place where the water droplets in the clouds returns to the ground in the form of rain. The plant's root absorb water from the ground and passes to the leaves. Again, the cycle begins. Transpiration, condensation, and precipitation. When we see dark clouds, we know it is likely to rain. The clouds are dark because it is full of big water droplets that blocks the light from the sun. Do you know the difference between rain and drizzle? Big, heavy water droplets falling to the ground are called rain. Small water droplets falling to the ground are called drizzle. Drizzle falls very slowly than rain. It takes about 700 drizzle drops to make one raindrop. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share the video. Thank you for watching Make It Easy Education.